As Hurricane Sandy hit the South Carolinas today, the unfortunate HMS Bounty, a replica of one of the most famous ships in the world, has had to be rescued 160 miles from the eye of the storm and its 17-strong crew airlifted to safety after 40 miles per hour winds and 18-foot waves overcame the boat. The Coast Guard sector, North Carolina, received a call from the owner of the 180-foot ship seen here in quieter times, saying she had lost communication with the vessel's crew late on Sunday evening. An air crew arrived on the scene and regained contact with the ship after receiving a signal from the emergency position, which indicated the beacon belonged to the bounty. Elsewhere, Sandy, a Category 1 hurricane, seen here in a time-lapse animation courtesy of NASA, is currently about 380 miles southeast of New York City, with winds of about 85 miles per hour. It's gathering speed on its trail as well, according to experts. Authorities are warning New York could get hit with an 11-foot wall of water that could swamp parts of Lower Manhattan, flood subway tunnels and cripple the network of electrical and communication lines that are vital to the nation's financial centre. The eye of the storm, spreading hundreds of miles across, is expected to land across the coast of mid-Atlantic states by tonight, according to the National Hurricane Centre. And experts have added that no matter how strong it is when it lands, the rare hybrid monster storm, dubbed Frankenstorm, will cause havoc over 800 miles from the East Coast to the Great Lakes. I'm Ann Salter. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the very latest news on Hurricane Sandy with us at ibtimes.co.uk.